I'm your Fox 47 neighborhood reporter, Darius Udris. After a two and a half hour closed door discussion, the Jackson School Board of Education announced an authorization to begin negotiating a separation with Superintendent Jeff Beal. The discussion was prompted by an errant text message Beal had sent, disparaging board member Keisha Hamilton. But the text was sent to Keisha Hamilton. Tuesday, Beal offered an apology. Ms. Hamilton, um, I apologize for the hurt that I caused you. I apologize for the inadvertent text that made your way. I cannot sit in your shoes. I do not receive it in the manner in which you would receive it. And I understand the unprofessional nature and how that is uh, beneath me. The meeting agenda was changed prior to the meeting, putting public comment after the closed door session. Those who had gathered to comment waited two and a half hours for the opportunity. We have come to principal, we have come to superintendents, Nothing is done. Many citing instances they described as retaliatory and discriminatory action by Superintendent Beal. While heated at times, order was maintained by two police officers. No, no, that's not the policy. We have it printed on today's policy. If you're amending the law, you're amending the law, you're a liar. Few spoke up in defense of Beal. It needs to be pointed out that the scandalous Playboy text message is being used as a pretext destroyed Jeff Bill's career JPS was sent on July 23rd, but the crafty and conniving Keisha Hamilton kept it in right in her sleeve, didn't she, sweetheart? And she was last Friday. Your wife will never make the board. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever you say, losers. Many criticized the board, saying it shared responsibility for the atmosphere in which the scandal occurred. In your neighborhood, I'm Darius Udris, Fox 47 News.